guys, it's Fitz from me here and welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well today. So I am back in with another, well, not cash challenge. I'm actually creating two characters that I would like uh, to use in my um, eco living series. If all goes well tomorrow, hopefully I should have uh, the eco living pack and we can go around and explore that together. Um, but I kind of wanted two characters in it that I could use, so this is just them. Um, so my plan for eco living is to actually not focus on the eco part of it, but it's actually to, um, well, kind of destroy the world and make it like a dystopian, cloudy, foggy, smoggy mess, really. <laughs> um, I kind of like that thing of that there is actually a choice that you can make to make the world bad. Um, it's kind of like The Sims 3 what is it back not back to the future but you know that pack i never played with that pack but i kind of like it that you can have a dystopian looking world so that is my aim first thing to do with this game is to well actually the first thing to do is i want to build container homes these guys are going to live in container homes but the second thing is uh destroying the world and making it a worse place because you know what the sims is too perfect for my luck in it and we need some destruction in it um so yeah i kind of want that vibe and that aesthetic and that so my aesthetic for these sims is kind of like a cyberpunky type thing. I want it to be dystopian, futuristic, that kind of vibe. So that is sort of what I've gone for here. Um, I have made, I've gone back in since recording this. Uh, this video was meant to go out yesterday, but unfortunately I couldn't. Um, and I have made some tweaks to them. I've changed her eyes out and I also, I still need to do this to find him that best because his best is dead boring. Um, but yeah, I just wanted some different things for these guys to look a bit different. So that hair is a really cool fun hair. You can only get it in black though, but not that's a problem. But yeah, I like it. It's cool. It's fun. It's interesting. Um, I didn't take the clips out of her hair because there was something else it clashed with. I forgot what that was, but I preferred the other thing to the clips. The clips do end up coming out of her hair. Um, but doesn't she look so cute and innocent? Uh, but she's like total badass and stuff. I did actually download a katana sword as well. And I was like, maybe she should have a sword. But I kind of wanted it on her back when it was in her hand. And I was like, I don't know how having a sword will do. But yeah. Um, I don't know because I've not seen. Because um, obviously, you know, the game changers had the packs. Um, only a few of them did. And then the rest of everybody else got it yesterday evening. And I don't know, there's not many videos that come out on it yet. And nobody's really talked about the aspect of making it a bad world except from Bella, but she I don't think she explored that. I don't know if she did explore that. Um I know that she kinda wanted to make it smog town and stuff. But I don't know if there's any traits or anything that specifically bump it up. That's something that we can explore together to make the world a worse place. Um yeah, so these clothes, custom contact clothes that I found online, if you put in I put in like cyberpunk, but if you put in like fantasy stuff as well this creator comes up um for that there is some trousers that she's supposed to wear with it but i didn't think it kind of went with her aesthetic and i do end up changing the top even though i do really like that top i think it's cool but nothing went and it clipped really bad on quite a lot of things but i think if you put it with the trousers it goes but i just didn't like trousers on those trousers i didn't like them it didn't fit with her vibe and i could do quite a lot of top that i ended up going for in the end i think it's fun um, with the big baggy sleeves. She's also got like a thing on her arm as well. I don't know how I put it on yet. I don't know how. We'll see it in the um, Where it's like a screen thing on her arm, like an intergalactic thing. It's a futuristic kind of vibe that I was going for. Um, so yeah, we'll see it in a sec. But that's kind of what I wanted to go for. This cyberistic, punky, futury, bad, dystopian look. These are going to be like the Jesse and James of, of Pokemon. The anti-heroes, the bad people, the ones that are doing the wrong things and messing up for everybody else. Whether we'll be able to succeed or not, I don't know. It's a different question, so we'll have to see. But yeah, I ended up... I randomised the names, um, but I ended up changing that last name for Rocket. And I also give them a cat. Uh, so they have got a cat when we go into it. They should have a cat as well. Um, so yeah, and I've also, I also went in and changed all the outfits as well. So the patch came out last night, changing the subject. What do we guys think of all the free stuff that we've got? I kind of think this is like the 20th anniversary thing that we should have deserved originally. Not that hot dog, not that monstrosity. Um, so I kind of do think this is kind of like, yeah, we're stepping up, bringing good things out this 
year for it and stuff so like ladders are exciting i can't wait to use those i didn't actually use anything the only thing i actually looked at last night was the max stuff and oh my god is it atrocious yes yes it is i didn't even know we were getting it but i mean what is that eyeliner with that blurry stuff on the side look at this eye thing how cool is that and it actually if you look at it like up close we downloaded the bottom thing flashes i was like oh my god it's so good um so yeah i'm kind of gonna set a story that it's like a thing for i don't know seeing all the pollution all the bad stuff and everything and i've also got maths as well so i think i'll do an outfit rather than go out they've got maths as well um back to the max stuff yeah no i hate it hate it it's trash it's actually trash i mean who how did that get through quality control seriously Ugh. but then i don't know looking at what other people did about the clothes and stuff apparently the clothes look good so that's kind of a good thing um but yeah how he's also got a leg back on that's really cool and both of them i forgot to say both of them have got like a bionic arm so the girl has a bionic arm so you can't really see it because unfortunately it's under the arm with the big sleeve on and i can't change it um she's it's a tattoo and it's it's about it's a proper bionic arm so she's actually lost her arm and this is uh, another arm piece obviously he's still got his arm but it doesn't quite work right so he's kind of got a robotic arm which i thought was fun and different and interesting and sort of futuristic -y. though sims need to step up their game and include disability in this game they're the only people that don't have representation in it and this is a life simulator and Fortunately or unfortunately, whichever way you look at it, disability is a thing and it needs to be included. 100%. 100%. Oh, you can kind of see it there, so you can see her white on her fingers and stuff. So it's cool. So she's called Phoenix and I ended up going to a couple of randoms for her because I couldn't find anything and then I was like, what do I call them? I was like, I'll do a couple more random others and she called Phoenix. They have got traits now, but I will see if there is any bad traits and change them. I don't think there will be. Oh, that was an accidental pose. <laughs> She's like a pregnant pose. And then he's called Xavier as well. So they're fun names. Fun names. Um, I don't know if they've got a relation. They haven't got a relation at the moment. Whether they will do or not, I don't know. I might just send it to each other. They have both got the same last name. But maybe they're like, I don't know, like some adopted brother and sister kind of stuff that got picked up by somebody and that kind of thing. Anyway, that's them. That's me. I've done it all. He, he, he. I hope you have a like and enjoy this video if you have please subscribe and i will see you guys in another episode thanks bye